that you've ever written on? The biggest waves How would far? have to be, um, I would say in Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. where I almost died surfing. Really? That's you where did? I surf clean again. I tried it and then like oh, there was no. no waves for the longest time. And right when I was about to come back, it was big. Oh no! <laughs> That's why I was like, yeah, I don't know. You're like, I don't know about surfing. Yeah, no more, yeah. Yeah. Where were you at? On oh, North Shore? Just playing camp on the river. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, wow. Well. So, so you're big, where was Yeah, in Sunset Beach on the North Shore of Oahu. Um, it's not too big, but I'd probably say like, I don't Three know. Three stories high? Yeah, well, we'd say, we go in feet, so yeah. like 10 feet, but like maybe a yeah, double overhead, so maybe like two people on top of each other. Two people on top of each other? I don't know, or okay. more. A wall. Yeah, two um, people or more. Um, I, it's um, hard to measure. I'll translate the 10 feet. <laughs> yeah, these are mini waves in compared Yeah, it's smaller though. But I think it's good for the, the girls and... Yeah, and the boys. And the boys, on the long boards at least. Definitely. I remember being at contests and uh, just being tired. Like tired, you. like you stay in your wetsuit or in your bikinis all day long. You get home and you just like fall asleep in your sunscreen and you're all salty. And mom's like, go get a shower. I'm like, yeah, you're like, no, I'm too tired. I'm gonna go to sleep. But yeah, it's a pretty crazy feeling. But um, I loved, yeah, I love being that. that yeah, you've been for a long time. You still love it. Like the never-ending grommet, just and all the world tours. Do you ever get sick of like the traveling, or you only live for like? Um, I think it's tiring. Yeah, when you're constantly like packing and unpacking and packing, and it's it's like non-stop. Yeah. But um, I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. I love traveling. It's just so wonderful to see the world and to meet the people I meet, to collaborate with different people on different projects and uh, yeah, at all the places I've been. I actually just bought a, a map, like a little kid. You know how you get a yeah, map yeah, and you like point right out, right. put the pins where you want to go? Yeah. I had a, yeah, I, well, there's still so much more to do, but I definitely had a few, um, a few uh, dart things up there. So. Yeah. But there's so many little islands everywhere. I know, in Thailand. I'm like obsessed favorite. with Google Earth. Because you can go on, you can like zoom right in and you can see, you can actually see waves and, and yeah. reefs and see if there's way, like a potential perfect wave. And it's pretty, I don't know, I spent hours on that just staring at setups, looking for waves. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I also heard about the, uh, are you doing a video, some, a surf video of some sort? Um, oh, I've always got projects in the mix, but um, yeah, I actually have a film, I have a film coming out soon. Um, How soon? Two months? Probably, yeah, it'll be out like next year, start of next year, I think. Um, and it's about um, me, of course. Cool. Um, I duh. Have guys surfing videos, you know? I know. Well, this one is not so much a surfing video, but okay, it's more right. about, it's like a documentary. It's oh, kind of like yeah. a, yeah, it's like a visual journal. Cool. Um, and it was it's a girl, a, a friend of mine who's been traveling with me. Uh, she's from New York, she's a filmmaker. So we've been traveling for like three years now and just capturing everything from surfing to hanging out in Paris to, you know, just watching music in New York to just a little bit of everything. So it's kind of like... What's it called? Is it coming out? We don't know yet. Okay. We're still, we're like in the final stages of getting it all ready and we still don't have a name, but uh, it'll probably involve my name somehow. So how we find out about it? Through... Facebook. I'll keep you posted. Yeah, on my Facebook, uh, Instagram, Twitter. Okay. It's all on. Aaron so quick. Hopefully, sometime this year. Yeah, it'll be out. I'm sure. We we just don't believe in the word deadline. So. Uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> deadline sucks. I know it's the worst. Awaken the spirit of surfing. It's inside of everyone. Um, yeah. I. What awakens my spirit is just. 
I mean, to be here at the beach and to just to breathe and to go surfing, to ride waves that have traveled from way, way out to sea. And then you're, you're catching that wave and the last dying moments before it crashes and disappears. Uh -huh. It's the most beautiful thing, I think. And uh, I, yeah, that's probably what gets me so excited and inspi inspired every day. Because every single day is different. Yeah, the waves are different. The sure. waves are different every single day, no matter where you are in the world. For you, probably the waves are different because you're in a different beach every day. Yeah, and around the world. Different beach, different country, uh, different. <laughs> yeah, rub it in, rub it in. <laughs> you should come. You can yeah, be my uh, my super caddy. Yeah, you need you need that. You can carry my boards. Yeah, totally. Wax my boards. Where are you going next? I'm heading back to Australia cool. and then, uh, yeah, home for like a week and then I'm going to France and then off to America and around. I kind of just like do circles around the world non-stop. But still, every time it's different, right? Yeah, every time it's different, different things, meeting up with different people and yeah, it's amazing. Awesome. I'm so spoiled. <laughs> I know you are. Thank you though. Thank you for sharing this with us. No worries. Have Thanks a good for time me. with the rest of the day. I'll Thank you. Surf clinic. Yeah, let's go surf. Okay. To all my Thai friends, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this interview. And uh, I love Thailand. I love the food. I love the people. Your culture is absolutely beautiful. And I'm very, very excited to come back. So hopefully I'll see you soon. Yeah.